Oh, welcome to the Quint. Uh, we are here to talk about a quiet place. Uh, so, do you remember watching the first part? And how did you get this second part? Well, okay, you go. You, yeah, you tell the story. You have to tell. It's such a beautiful story. So I went. I went to see the movie in the in the cinema with my sons, my two sons, and uh, we 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 thought it was amazing, uh, and we absolutely loved the film. I thought it was one of the you know the finest films of the year, and I um, I was so impressed by the film that I. I, I composed an email to John Krasinski to tell him how much I love the movie, but I never sent I never sent the email because I was too embarrassed. <laughs> and then he sent me an email like a year a year later. So was it was it like a shock? Yeah, yeah it was surprising. Yeah, it was surpri but I'm glad he didn't story? send the first email. Isn't that a beautiful story? Yeah. What about you? Uh, well, mine was just very much uh, simpler, and I didn't really uh, no. But I was certainly. Uh, 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 very surprised about his uh, um, directorial debut. I thought he was a, just a beautifully uh, uh, film, made film, right? And um, so that said, I got the call to uh, to come on the second one. It was like a no-brainer. I didn't really have to read the script. So what sets John apart from other directors? Well, that's a good question. I mean, obviously, he's such an accomplished actor as well. Yeah. Um, for me, I think it's quite phenomenal for for someone to to arrive as such a fully formed director. He's quite extraordinary the way he can communicate to actors. Very, very, very um, delicate the way he t talks. Obviously, he's also written the movie, you know, and and obviously Emily is his wife. So it's a very, very special environment to be involved with, and you feel very, very lucky to be involved in such a creative uh, environment. Uh, lovely family. You look in uh, one of your shows called Peaky Blinders, uh, people have been talking about it and it has become a fashion trend. And now people are talking about your beard. Oh. So how much uh, do you participate in thinking about how your characters are gonna look? Well, I mean, uh, yeah, we talked to, to, talk to John about it. Obviously, uh, uh, you know, it's a, the, the, the men would be a bit, you know, uh, more hirsute than, than general because because of the situations, but uh, yeah, we, you know, all of the costume was very much about where he used to work. He would have worked in a steel, a steel uh, factory, um, so that we, we took a lot of the costume, and made the badge of the old steel factory and the cap from the old steel factory. So all of those details were we put in to the story, you know. How was it working with an actor who is deaf, uh, having her around, and working with her? How was that experience? I mean, she's phenomenal. As you can tell from watching the movies, both movies, and she's a phenomenal actor, and she's also a phenomenal person. Genuinely, she has a kind of a, Millie has a kind of an aura. Yeah, I, I would say that uh, being around her on set, uh, she has uh, her presence is a, has a, an effectuous uh, sort of like a uh, feeling to, to with the, the crew and everybody. Yeah. in a way, she's so electrifying. You know? Yeah. Have you ever watched Indian films? I've watched Indian films. I can't tell you specifically what uh, uh, the name of those Indian films, but uh, I've come across, obviously some of us grow up with, uh, yeah. in different parts of the world with uh, a lot of times with Indian films or Nigerian films, but uh, yeah. What about you? No? It's I don't very, think I have. I don't think I have. Um, no. That's a terrible thing to say. Must, must oh watch yes, I know the one Indian film. You know, uh, was it it um, uh, Shaker Kapoor's film about Bandit Queen? Yes. Bandit Queen. That was a very, oh, very oh, poignant I film. Bandit Queen. That was one memorable film. That I remember. Yes, it's it's a. And it's because amazing. of Shaker Kapoor also yes. because he was such a great uh, director. Because it's a scary film. Your favorite scary film? Do you remember any of your favorites? Oh, The Shining is mine. Yeah. Number one, Shani is definitely a good yeah. one. Um, uh, Poltergeist. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's another one that was good. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you for talking to us. Thank nice you. to talk to you.